what's up bloggers and writers in today's video i want to guide you on how you can bypass ai detection for free you are not going to spend any money to do this it's completely for free so just stay here with me and make sure you hit that like button as we get started so i want to generate the content over here and i want the content to be 100 percent ai or it should be fully ai so i'm going to use google bad in this case so this is google bad i am here and then i'll be putting this prompt into google bad that says write a long form article with markdown element on can dog eat banana so i'm putting this prompt into google bad and then i'm waiting for google bad to write a long form blog post for me over here the aim is that i need ai generated content so that i'll be able to change that content for you to see so let google bad write the content for us so right here google bad has generated the article for us over here and then this is what we need to do let me just copy this article and let's go and find out in case this article is really ai or not so i've selected it and let me just copy it now for us to check whether it's written by ai or not let's go to this website that detects ai writing that is zero gpt so let me just paste the content over here You don't need to worry because i'll be leaving every link in description for you now after i've pasted this content over here let's just come over here and click dictate text so right now you can see your text is ai generated and is over 78 percent over here so this test is fully ai generated so right now i want to bypass ai detection so let me show you how we can do that we are going to use ChatGPT to bypass AI detection. But how can we use ChatGPT? First, you must have ChatGPT account, that is OpenAI account. So just go to chat.openai.com so that you can be able to have access to ChatGPT. Now, after you've logged into your ChatGPT dashboard, I'm going to show you something over here for you to do now. Just go into your browser. I'll be leaving this link also in description, but I want to show you first. You can also go to your browser like this in Google that you search AIPRM and then you put this search into Google. So let me search it again. You can see it has appeared like this. And when this screen comes, you'll be seeing AIPRM for ChatGPT, the second prompt over here or the second search result over here. This is what we want. Remember, AIPRM for ChatGPT. That is what we want. But don't worry, just check the description again. You're gonna see this link. And when you click on this link, it will simply land you on this page over here. And all you have to do is to come to your right hand side, the top over here. You're gonna see Add to Chrome. In this case, you are seeing Remove from Chrome because I've added it already. So your own will be showing add to chrome make sure you click on that add to chrome and definitely this browser extension is going to be added to your chat gpt automatically so in my case i've added it already and when i come over here to the top of my browser you can see aiprm for chat gpt is over here let me pin it down here and let's go to chat gpt now now you can see my chat gpt is looking completely different because i'm having that kind of extension the same way i've opened it first for you to see so how do you pass that ai detection over here all you have to do is to check the place that it says topics and make sure the topic is on copywriting and then make sure activity is on all so when you select these two things over here just scroll down and then scroll down a little bit you're gonna see a prompt over here that is saying try to pass ai detection to text make sure you search for this is very important remember i said copywriting for the topic and then activity should be all then you scroll down a little bit you're gonna see try to pass ai detection to text make sure you click on it so when you click on it it's gonna ask you to put the content over here so the same content that i've copied from google bad i'm going to copy it once again for you to see 
and then i will come to ChatGPT and come and put that same content over here and then i'm gonna hit this place so let's wait for ChatGPT to bypass ai detection for us so right now ChatGPT has finished writing the content for us and remember the same content we put over here is the same thing ChatGPT is going to rewrite for you so don't worry about the quality of it let's just go and copy the content and then let's go back to zero chat gpt and then this time around let me remove the old content that was ai content so let me just select this and then let me delete the old content you can see i've deleted the old content completely now let me add the new content or let me paste the new content written by ChatGPT. So let's click here the text test and see. So you can see your test is human written. It tells you that there is nothing over here that shows AI written text. So this has passed AI detection 100%. You can see zero AI over here. It tells you that this particular method has passed AI detection 100%. Now, some people will be asking question, is this content quality? Remember, I said the same content we've written is what ChatGPT is going to rewrite for you. So, in case you want it to be quality, make sure you write a quality content using SEO writing AI, for example. I'll be leaving the link in the description also. Make sure you write the quality content before you put into this particular prompt in chat gpt and you are going to get the good results over here so this is how you bypass ai detection for free you are not going to spend any money make sure you check the link in description for my ebook over there that is my digital marketing ebook that can guide you on how you can make money online and also make sure you check the link and purchase your hosting right now from namecheap because namecheap is running a promo make sure you do that and if you want somebody to design your website for you also make sure you check the link and get in touch with me and you are going to get the perfect blog all right see you in the next video